Oh yeah, we're coming back, baby. Alrighty. So, after some thorough investigation, aka watching somebody else do the weekly challenge like once, um, you just have to get the ghost type correct. You don't need to do the actual apocalypse challenge stuff. Am I missing my apocalypse challenge match? What the hell happened there? So, we're gonna do that again. We're gonna finish that up today. Um... Yeah, we're probably not going to take any three-star ghost photos. And if we have some extra time, maybe we'll go and start completing some objectives in Tanglewood. While also, I mean, no matter what, we're going to discover the ghost type. Because we're at least going to do that once or twice. We're not going to get a spirit box response from that unless we manage to get uh, objectives on Tanglewood. Might try to get all the objectives on Tanglewood. Yeah, you guys like longer videos. Fuck it. We'll try to get all these dailies tasks done too. So... Got that set up for challenge mode. Let's go and set this on to... Oh, oh, now I got my thing back. Cool. This doesn't show up normally. Set this to restricted. <clears throat> See if I can talk without losing my voice. And let's do this. Slowly while we wait for all of this to load. This is... Okay, good. It's recording. Um... So, that being said, all we need is night vision so we can actually see lighter smudge and what else do we want honestly i'm going to take the video cam because if we could mimic i don't want to get duped by it again we instant hunt should maybe be a bit more prepared for that that's concerning is it an entryway shade what ghosts wouldn't be hunting right now? Yeah, that's not a good thing. Let's go see what our setup is. We'll probably run into the ghosts as well. Left side blocked. Kept the bone. Didn't even know it could spawn there. Looks like we can continue going to the right. Hunt is over. Not seeing any ghost orbs. Also don't have cold breath right off the bat. Need to scroll down from this in order to get to my, uh, smudge. Ideally, I find one of these that'll be half decent to dip into. This one might be good. There we go, and I can actually talk while we're doing this. Still not eager to hunt. That is peculiar. Why wouldn't something want to hunt? Oop. There we go. I don't even hear it. Like, I don't hear it at all. What the hell? So that's another hunt where we didn't even hear the ghost. Guess it could technically be all the way down here at the end and just never ventured very far. It seems unlikely. That works. It is all the way down here. Well, let's try to hide. 
for the impending hunt. This is the best spot. That sounded a bit peculiar. That sounded like it might have honestly been a hauntu. No ghost orbs. I do need to grab a couple smudges. I'm not sure I'll be able to get out of this area though. I'd honestly need to get it to go into a different room, preferably a warmer room. Not exactly ideal that it is a crawly ghost. Well, at least I don't have to wait for it to. Oh, well, speaking too soon there, I might have to wait for it to get through another hunt before I can get out the front door. It's still a bit peculiar that it's not eager to hunt. That's uh, a bit strange on this because I'm essentially 0% sanity from the start. Could be a shade? I had cold breath in that room unless it had just moved to that room. It definitely sounded like it slowed down for no reason. Uh, oh, nice. Got both of those. Cool. Yeah, definitely no ghost orbs, so at least we don't have to deal with the mimic. Never actually managed to spot ghost orbs in this hallway, so that's not the most useful. Oh, back into the fray. Ideally, it moves from there because that kind of sucks. Seems like it is a average speed ghost, but I'm not sure why it would have slowed down. Definitely wasn't a Diogen. Still isn't hunting. Jesus. Oh, it's not eager to hunt. I'm not familiar with a ghost that's not eager to hunt. Hmm. Might not be able to get this one. Although we don't need to live, we just need to get the ghost right. Still not hunting. Now it is. This will be ideal to catch it if it has cold breath. Come on, ghosty, come on. Oh, it's done. Alright, this is going to be less than ideal. So, scroll down from this one and we get to our other smudge. They're pretty much going to have to back up. They're not going to be able to outrun pretty much any of these ghosts, not at this speed. But we're going to definitely have to try. Then we'll smudge it. We'll try to keep an eye, see if it has cold breath. I'm not sure why it would have slowed down. Why would it have slowed down? Definitely not deal or Revenant. They wouldn't slow down if it gets close to a player. Surprised that is out of his range. Oh, it just made this to go through. Stupid smudge stick. I think it's over already. I didn't see any cold breath on the ghost model. Why would the ghost slow down? And why is it not eager to hunt?
I'm going to do a yokai test. If I'm wrong, I'm dead. If I'm right, then I'm right. We don't have to do this anymore. We just gotta hope the ghost kinda comes over this way. Like, about here. This should be good. Here, throw some stuff around. Definitely changing ghost rooms a fair bit. Why wouldn't it be? Thank you, that was right in my ear holes, you dick. I'm thinking either yokai or shade at this point. I'm not seeing anything from the hunt itself. Although I guess it did not seem to speed up with line of sight. Maybe I should go back to haunt you. Definitely doesn't look like I had cold breath. I gotta do this standing, otherwise I'll be screwed. Yeah, look at that guy. I'm a good yokai. It's either yokai or shade, I feel. Now I'm not even sure entirely why I'm going yokai. I think when I did the smudge test the last time, it uh, kind of ignored me, even though I still had my head cam on. For night vision. <clears throat> Let's see what it was. Jin! Welcome back. I've prepared to I've, for you. There's no reason that Jin shouldn't have wanted to hunt. Like, we, we should probably see what this next... I also was not going to get a gin, not with the broken breaker. I might have been able to put an EMF meter on the breaker and see if it tried to turn it on. Obviously, it would not succeed, but it, I think it still tries. Should do some testimony someday and see if we can uh, watch it do that. But, uh... Yeah, with the broken breaker, you pretty much can't tell a gin unless it does that. That's what I expect. Let's go ahead and pop these guys on. Right side again. But not there. We have uh, around back in the courtyard. Can't even use that to test. It's still hunting. Nope, it's done. Guess we can keep an eye out for the bone. Wouldn't hurt. I think I'm just gonna keep an eye out for the ghost instead. Standard blink, which I don't think is particularly good in this case. Go ahead and chuck that there. I think this might be another one we're not going to get. Um, yeah, I was thinking standard blink. That might not be good in this case, though, because the blink should be sped up quite a bit. So this might be a phantom at the higher speed. What do I have for cams? That is just reception. That's not going to be helpful. There's the courtyard. I think the ghost is actually in the hallway. A oh, nice cleanse and repel. Parabolic's not a terrible idea. I feel like I could hear it well enough, so it's not likely a myelin. And nothing about that really screamed, uh, Banshee. So if not a Hauntu or a Thay or a Dio, I don't think that- No, that was an Amoroi because we're at 0% sanity. It definitely sounded like it got close or faster when it got closer, but that might have just been the prolonged line of sight. But 
could technically have been a Raiju. Let's take some salt in there. And we already have the video cam, so we'll try to set that down as well. Do a, a Raiju and a Wraith test. Problem with the salt is I pretty much want to see it go through the salt. That should be pretty good. Door still open. That's interesting. one in the hallway which is pretty vague but I'm not getting any ghost orbs so there's that still isn't haunting oh I smudged it I wonder if it's a spirit oh I think it just closed the door yeah it did I uh, even still I wonder if it's a spirit Oh, apparently it was haunted at some point during that and stopped already. Wow. Okay. Um, what do I want to do now? I guess we'll take in, we'll take in a parabolic because we need that for the objective and I like money. Although I guess it's only one times rewards. Keep an eye on that door. Apparently I can bring it pretty far this way, but uh. I don't want to screw with that. I also want to try to smudge it and set a timer. Playing around with the sink somewhere. Got a whisper already. There's that. Bro is struggling to breathe. I think this is a Raiju. Yep, I'ma call that a Raiju. Unless it's a mimic and it's actually hiding in that room, but if that's the case, that's dumb. Yeah, that guy sped up a lot. I didn't give him that much line of sight either, so... We're gonna go with that one. Pretty much put a bunch of handheld electronics powered on in about the same spot and wait for the ghost to speed up like crazy. And that's how you tell if you have a Raiju. Apparently I was also talking out of my ass there. That was just the fat... That guy he sped up a lot. I guess that was a fast twin. I'm also nowhere near used to using this kind of ghost speed. So I only do like 13 times rewards challenges. Keep the ghost speed and player speed the same. And you get a lot more money than this even when you fail. <laughs> uh, one of these times we'll get something relatively easy. I'm surprised these ghosts aren't, uh... That's a Hantu! Got him. You can see the, uh, the cold breath on the ghost model. It'd be really cool if you could even see it in here. Either that or is a mimic, and if that was a mimic, that's gonna suck. Now let's verify that you don't actually need to live, you just need to get the ghost right. Hauntu, very nice. Called that last second, and... You just need to get the ghost right, you do not need to live. And it's not really worth living, because 
you don't get very much money if you do. <laughs> what, what did I get for doing the, the perfect investigation one? Like, I was definitely less than a thousand, and that was dumb. I gotta turn off the AC because it is blaring right now. And there's not really a reason for it. Let's right, set that to here. 69. Take a look at the equipment and prepare accordingly before starting the investigation. New intel. Reports of light switching. Uh, I don't care about any of that. Keep forgetting about that. Let's get this one more time. Give me something easy. Oh, I forgot about the night vision, didn't I? Gotta get my nogs on. Here we go. Oh yeah, everything's green. Instant. No. Does that make me explore a bit before you try to kill me? Fine. Be that way. I haven't gotten the downstairs once yet, which is beautiful. timer's gonna be a little bit off because I keep forgetting to set it. Um, holy shit, that was quick. And I think it's in the chapel area. So we got a little bit less than a minute to go and check it out. I should also go and grab another smudge stick. We're just gonna place that in here. We actually have a camera in the van that is uh, hooked up in here. What do we have? It's been 30 seconds so far, probably closer to 40, because I completely forgot to set my smudge as soon as I hit the thing. Let's grab a couple smudges, hop back in there, and be ready. I believe in myself. Alright, demon can hunt right about now. Ghost definitely didn't seem to have a lot of speed to it, I'll say that much. It's pretty nice that we could just use this door right here as a hunting indicator rather than diving into the facility. Because there's definitely nowhere to hide. I don't think there's anywhere to hide at all on this. And any ghost should be able to hunt right about now. And I guess if uh, nothing happens, we'll sit here for about another minute. Okay, a little bit more than a minute, but you know. Three minutes for the spirit. Let's go. Do -do 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 -do. Yeah, they should definitely make those eyes track you. That'd probably be a pain in the butt for uh, programming and oh, not a spirit. Same speed as last time, so definitely not the twins this time. Or, almost definitely not the twins. Gee, I'm gonna put this one in here too. We're gonna go grab the other smudge and a pair of ball, because it's been another singing hunt. I'm curious if it's a banshee this time. And if I feel like if it is, then it should have tried to come near me. But, you know, actually, we'll leave that one in there. We'll grab these two. I'll put the salt down, and we'll see if it walks through it. I should definitely have been keeping a count here. See if I can get out this door and grab a smudge. There we go. I'll put the salt down after uh, this next hunt. We'll go from there. And since I have two inventory slots open, uh, let's go ahead and uh, pop this open, check around for some ghost orbs. Just in case. 
might not still be in the chapel, but... Oh, and there's my camera there. Hasn't tried to knock it over yet. I was expecting the, the ghost to do that right there and then. Um, these don't work because that is a factor of apocalypse. Is uh, flashlights are off. So if you had tier two head equipment or any flashlight, including the ultraviolet flashlight, you'd be screwed. <coughs> um, so what do I want to do then? I don't need that for photos. I guess we could take one of these. We'll put it on the breaker box and possibly test for gin. Should be able to hear it from here. I could definitely hear it throwing more than I could hear it, uh, that was the end of a whisper right there, more than I could hear it walking, this may be a myling. That being said, I completely forgot that I was going to go and throw salt. Throwing some stuff around. Drop that all the way in the ground, damn. Feel like it's no longer in the chapel. Maybe. Maybe I'm hearing it in the courtyard now. And let's find out. I'm gonna toss this one here, here, and that's it's good. That was no cold breath in the chapel. Another whisper. It's peaking my myelin interest. Oh yeah, it's in the chapel. Stepped in my salt. Does have another wraith. Maybe a poltergeist. Wow, look at all that stuff. I never considered doing this. You can see how much the ghost is throwing. Yeah, that's a poltergeist. Holy crap. You see that? All the extra dots around there? It's got a lot of whispers, but holy crap. I'm gonna go polter on that one. That's a myelin. I'm gonna hate myself because I also feel like it's pretty quiet. But I mean, that might be a whole new strat to figuring up poltergeist. Put yourself just far enough out of the ghost range so it can't uh, sense you using an electronic, and then also use the parabolic in order to see how much it throws. Oh hell yeah! Oh, that's so clever. I'm not patting myself on the back on that one because I completely failed the challenge uh, on Monday. And I think I even let a demon go when I should have gotten it. So, yeah, you know, I'm not great at this game, but that, that is smart. All right, what else we got on here? Uh, complete some objectives in Tanglewood. How long have I been doing this for? About half an hour. We finished out those challenges. You know what? If you want to see some Tanglewood objectives and maybe a couple other of these weekly tasks then uh hit me up on saturday i'll have that video coming out about 10 10 or so in the morning on eastern time so 
Thanks you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed. If you could like, comment, or subscribe, I would appreciate it because anything you could do for the channel helps me put more back into the channel for you. I'm starting to get more used to my new job, so I should be able to start making content a bit better. I was basically drained and dead tired the first two weeks, but now we're getting better. So I will see you next time. Have a good one.